Hello everyone, it's Jen. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and my craft table. So you'll have to pardon my voice. I've been a little under the weather this week, but I wanted to get out a um, short little video on decorating some gift bags. And this is basically a culmination of Teacher Appreciation Week gifts that we will be handing out next week. And so I put together some gift bags for the things that we've made and used the adhesive vinyl in a variety of solids and patterns to create individual bags for each teacher for each day of the week. And the good thing about this is that each day my daughter, when she goes to school, she will be able to hand the correct bag to the correct teacher without having to open the bags and rifle through them and see if the gift that's inside is for the teacher that she is talking to at that moment. So let me go ahead and just show you in design space the overall um, design of what I've created and then we'll come back and I'll show you kind of how all of these fit together. Okay so in design space the only thing I really did is I spent some time with the monogram feature down here in the lower left and I created these seven um, simple monogram designs each one with the last initial of one of her teachers. These are for these small keychain gift bags. And right now they're all in the same color and that was mainly for cutting purposes, but each one is a different design, color, or pattern for the vinyl when it's actually um, adhered to the gift bag. Then I have, um, let's see, these in the top right are gift bag decals for the notepads that we've made, the custom notepads, and actually inside each one of these little boxes right here, the teacher name is uh, print, or not printed out, but um, cut out of adhesive vinyl as well. So there's one for every teacher. In the bottom right, we have the designs for the coaster bags. And so it's kind of like a coaster with an initial. Some have like a confetti um, motif and some have flowers. And then finally, and these are kind of almost my personal favorite. It's actually a toss up between that and the little notebook bags. But these are for the um, customized mugs that we made for each teacher. And it's just um, a patterned vinyl. And then on top of that, we did a solid um, round, or I guess it's oval actually, um, design with the cutout of the teacher's initial. So now that I have shown you what the overall design look is, let's head back to the overhead camera and I'll show you what all of the designs actually look like once they've been adhered to the backs. I'm just going to go through each day of the week that we plan to give these out. So the first day of the week um, for Monday, we will be giving out these little treat boxes and these were made with craft board. On one side we have a monogram for each teacher in a different color of vinyl and then on the other side we have the treats um, little sign. It is so cute. It almost looks like chalkboard. And then obviously we would just open them up, fill them with favorite treats for each teacher, close them back up, and my daughter will be able to deliver those on Monday. So we thought that would be a really sweet, nice way to start off the week. Okay, so another day that we have is we have some personalized keychains. And each keychain has, um, actually I'll just show you because it's actually turned out way better than I thought they would. And these are acrylic keychains, and I actually covered them with resin. So not only is the vinyl protected, but they have just a smooth professional coating. And then each one, except for our athletic coach, I don't know that he would really like a tassel, but um, we have tassel for all the ladies. And so each one of these will be in its own little protective bag. And then we have these small gift bags, and this is what the monograms look like. So we have a variety of these, and these actually, each of the bags match their keychain. So 
that's kind of a fun idea. And my daughter already started putting these together. So she put each of the keychains in a bag and then just filled it with tissue paper. And then it looks really sweet and cute and very personal to each teacher. So another day that we have already put together are the notepads for each teacher. And these were the ones that we made in Canva and printed it out using our inkjet printer. We have the craft board backing and then um, we used Mod Podge to make the um, tear away uh, little feature at the top. So just like something you would buy in a store. And so each one of these notepads for each teacher that's, you know, it's personalized to them will be going in these personalized gift bags. So we have a pink flower. We have a globe. This is actually for our history teacher. We have a tulip type flower. We have our athletic coach, the art teacher, our mathematics teacher, and then our science teacher. So each teacher will just get, let's see, I think, in fact, I think this one, yes, this one is for our art teacher. And we'll basically, these are medium sized bags that I got at Hobby Lobby and it's like five to um, a pack. So I did have to buy two packs. Sorry, I guess that's kind of loud, huh? But then these fit very nicely in the bags. And then my daughter will be putting tissue paper in each one of these. So that will be a third day. So we've got those. Then on the um, fourth day, we have coasters. Now these are infusible ink coasters. And each one comes in a craft board holder that we made with a window. And these will go in each one of these. So I have um, some of them have a flower design. And then some of them, it's almost like a confetti in a way, or like a really kind of gives me an 80s vibe. But um, each teacher has their initial and here I did um, I did the black you know outline just like these other ones but I was worried it wouldn't show up so I put it on top of red vinyl and then I put the teacher's initial on top of that so each one of the coasters with along with tissue paper will go inside these bags here and then on Friday in addition to teacher cards that we have made, um, each teacher will be getting their own personalized card that was made specifically for them. And all of these were made using the Cricut. And there is a variety of um, like pr uh, scrap paper that has been used for embellishing um the dimensional elements but all of these were done not with any um, die cutting machine but actually on the Cricut and we have sticker paper and cardstock and ink blending as well so I'm really excited about handing these out on Friday and each one of those will go in a bag with a customized mug and I know teachers get a ton of them, but they are handy for everything from coffee to um, colored pencils to whatever they feel like. But each teacher has a personalized mug using infusible ink. And this one I just love so much. This is an Art Deco mug. And they will be, of course, wrapped in bubble wrap. And then for each teacher, we have their own personalized mug on the um, at a vinyl on the gift bag and I just thought these came out so cute 
and it was a great way to use up pattern paper and scrap pieces of vinyl. Okay, well that will do for this very short video that we wanted to share with you. Um, we will link the previous videos for each one of these crafts of the Teacher Appreciation Week for you to watch if you haven't already done so. They are some great ideas for teachers in your lives. And due to being a little under the weather this week, I think I am going to go ahead and head on out of the craft room and get some more rest. So until I see you next time, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can be up to date on everything that we post, including some Mother's Day ideas coming out very soon. I hope that this video was inspiring and helpful to you. And if it was, make sure that you hit that like button. That is an amazing way to support the channel and help the channel grow. And in the meantime, until I see you again, make sure you have a wonderful warm cup of coffee and happy crafting. Thank you all so much for watching today. I'm so glad that you can join me at my craft table. If you're not already, I'd love to have you as a subscriber and don't forget to hit that notification bell. That way you'll know when new videos arrive. Have a great day and as always, happy crafting.